work it. I put my thing down, flip it and reverse it. It's your primitive, it's my yet. It's your primitive, it's my yet. If you got a big one, let me search it. If I know how hard I gotta work yet. Alright, so. Today, I'm gonna show you how to jailbreak a fire stick. So, first thing you wanna do when you finally get your fire stick. You're gonna have options. I've already jailbroken this one, but I'm gonna show you the steps. So, first thing you wanna do is go to settings. I'm gonna go and press down, go to applications, and you're gonna turn collect app usage data, little data off. You're gonna go back, you're gonna go to device, go to developer options, Turn ADB debugging off and apps from unknown sources on. Next thing you're going to want to do is go to your home screen again and go to search. Is it worth it? Let me work it. I put my thing down, flip it and reverse it. It's your primitive, it's my yet. It's your primitive, it's my yet. If you got a big one, let me search it. If I know how hard I gotta work yet. And then go to E S. Explore, it usually pops up, so you just click ES Explorer. You're gonna click on it, and it won't pop up like this. But first thing you're gonna do is gonna go to Add, and then you're gonna go to Path. You're gonna type in HTTP colon backslash backslash. Oh wait, hold up. HTTP S. Usually it doesn't matter, but I'm this is how I've always done it, so we're gonna do it this way because I know this way it works. So backslash backslash and then go to Cody dot TV backslash Download. And usually you'd press next, but I've already done it. So you go to name. It'll if you press next, it'll go to name. So you then type in. I just do Cody, like so. And I'm gonna cancel. But usually, and when you click add, you'll come down on the left side, and you're gonna click on Cody. So you click it, and then you're gonna go scrolling down until you see uh, just scroll down you'll see all the releases click here so you press your middle button you're gonna go to Android ARM and then Cody 17.6 and you scroll left go down go to more open in browser I've already done it so it's not gonna let me do it again but uh, yeah, so then it'll download, it'll say open file, you click open file, and it'll say install. It will install. Then you can go back to your home menu, and after you do that, it should have a little bubble on the screen right here. So you, the, to get rid of that, you go to settings, you go to applications, go to manage install applications, and then find ES File Explorer. You click on it and click for stop and then there, the bubble will go away then you can go back to your home menu so the next thing you're gonna want to do is uh, to make it easier to find Cody you go to your apps and games and then go to see all and then you scroll down here you press the three buttons go to move to front and you can press back and it will always be on your home screen right here so you can click it you click it and it's gonna load up next thing you're gonna want to do is go to your settings little gear icon go to system settings scroll down to add-ons press right and then turn these two on 
and you can press back. You go to File Manager. You're gonna go to Add Source. Click here. H T T P colon slash slash. You don't need the S on this one because it it just doesn't matter. I don't know. So you click Repo dot J D I G G Z dot com and you press right you scroll down put the name and to make it easier you just do this this and this press OK click OK again and to know if you did it right you're gonna go here and it should say zip so you're gonna press your back button and you're gonna press back and you're scrolling down to add-ons. Press your middle button, go to this little box, press on it, go down to install from zip file, choose dot e no, XE, press your middle button again, and something should pop up. There it is, it should say digs repo. Scroll up to install from repository. Click on Digs Repo, Program Add-ons, and Digs Wizard. Click Install. And it should start downloading. And then it should pop up a menu right here. Press the back button, and then press left to go to Build Menu. You're going to scroll down to Xenon, press your middle button, Go to fresh install, click your button again, click continue, and then there it goes. I don't know what happened. <laughs> so my internet's kind of crap, so it's going to take a second, but I'm going to fast forward this part. Alright, if it goes to timeout, press your up button, like I just press it up on it. That way you don't have to press any buttons, don't press any back or anything, home because it'll mess it up or something. I'm, I'm not really sure. I haven't tried to press any of the back buttons or anything. I just press up to make it safe. <laughs> so it's going to download all the plugins and the videos and everything that is on here that you can do pretty much. So now that it's done, it's going to ask you if you want to reload or force close. Click force close. Now you can reopen Cody. Okay, so, now, you're going to have to let it load up for a minute, just let everything download, pretty much, like let everything just pop up, it has to put a lot of stuff on here, so just don't be impatient, <laughs> so I like to give it a minute to load, I mean you can, you can scroll if you want, but you can pretty much go to movies, TV shows, you got live TV plugins, uh, this will pop up, just click OK. It should go away. Yeah, sports. You can get UFC, wrestling, NFL, boxing, all this stuff. Music. You got all this. Pandora. But this is like the janky version. <laughs> I'm not sure. I've never really used any of the music or anything like that. So I just. Yeah. Whoa, I just noticed that. <laughs> what in the hell? World of Star Hip Hop teams. I guess, that, yeah. Live leak. This is kind of creepy. I'm not going to go into all that. I tend to stay away from these things. So, yeah. Yeah, see, so you can see it's adding all this stuff. So, usually when you're first loading it up, you don't want to mess with a bunch of stuff and make it or anything uh, and when you watch movies you can use any of these I've used all of them uh, this one seems to work pretty well um, but I mean you can use and search and go through you know just explore a little bit and then TV shows does the same thing your ad right here or my raid or it's not raid but yeah it looks like your I don't really know to be honest but you can use any of these and I mean you can pretty much play around and explore and it's doing some stuff now, but that's pretty much it. And that's your Joe Broken Fire Stick. 
on 17.6. This one tends to update a lot, but if it helped, uh, drop a like, comment if you have questions. I'm always on looking for people to comment, so if you need help, just let me know and I'm, I'll be glad to help anybody. <laughs>